there's so many opportunities right now for you to become an entrepreneur. Diba? Either you still work for a company, uh, Monday to Saturday, Monday to Friday, pero wag mo sasayangin yung Saturday and Sunday. Now is really an opportune time to do something. No, bro? Hello, good evening everybody. Tonight, welcome to another Passive Income Show. My name is Carly and I'm your host. And tonight, we're going to talk about entrepreneurship and digitizing your business. We're going to talk about, paano nga ba? Ang dami nagtatanong dyan, especially yung mga medyo old school. Paano nga ba ma- maging future ready ang aking business? Paano ko ba maging malagay sa online? And very appropriate or very timely ang ating guest right now because he is a digital guy. He is an entrepreneur guy na ang ang mindset niya ay palaging being a businessman, being future, looking into the future, and being open-minded sa mga, mga possible things that can happen in the future. He is the business development of a company called Prosperna Prosperna is a company that you want to know kasi they can help your company be online. Fro is my go-to guy when I want to, parang when I'm stuck in a rut and I need somebody na medyo creative ang mind for ideas, This he is my go-to guy. And now finally, we've invited him, my good friend to the show, to share. Very inspiring to guys. Pag nakakausap mo si Fro, parang... Parang gusto mo na mag-open ng negosyo ngayon din. <laughs> Hello, Fro. How are you? Hi, Carl. Good evening. Maraming salamat for the warm, very artful introduction. Maraming salamat. Good evening, Dry TV. Good evening, Bounce Back Network. And good evening, Prosper Nation. Yon, you deserve the introduction, pare. Bro, maraming nanonood dito na... I'm sure kilala ka na. May iba pa naman hindi ka pakilala. But in, in fairness sa mga hindi ka pakilala, Give us a little background of, of what you do. Again, uh, magandang gabi sa inyo lahat. I'm Fro Oliva, Head of Business Development for uh, Prosperna. Uh, Prosperna is an e-commerce solutions provider. So, perfect to. Kasi kung, especially with the situation right now, and things are changing, if you want to get into, if you want to get your business into the e-commerce space, then uh, Prosperna is the right partner for you. Because... You know, we help you create your website. Tapos may kasama na rin. Hindi nyo na kailangan isipin yung payment integration, kung paano kayo babayaran, pati paano nang deliver Kasi lahat yun, ipoprovide namin para sa inyo. Right? And yeah, outside that, you know, I, I've been, like what Carl said, I've been in uh, the business space for quite some time. I've actually had some success in uh, property as well, Carl. Right? Oh, pare. Uh, Tell us about it, pare. And uh, yeah, so there was a time that I was doing build and sell for a good uh, five years. Um, it was uh, I was able to find a sweet spot here in the south, a better living area. Uh, during the time that prices were still good, so I was able to purchase some land and then uh, you know uh, build on it and then flip it. Yon, very good experience. Yon, yeah, that's really the way to go. And guys, I want to. Flex a bit Prosperna. We are a customer of Prosperna. Our website was done by Prosperna. Uh, even my my relatives company, they also work with Prosperna. And I am going to tell you, it's not expensive. Diba? Good quality, not expensive. Diba? And it really can get your company up in the, e- in the, in the e-commerce space fast. Correct. So, kunyari, yeah. meron, yung labangit mo, Fro, kanina, you can do payment gateway na rin. Yes, yes. So, as you know, Carl, no? so, the nice thing about it is, uh, especially in the pandemic, diba? uh, you know, you know, uh, businesses were, halt, were, were put on halt for the start, right? But when you're negotiating, you're going to have to do it. 
paano makabente. And the pandemic really just pushed people to go digital. Kasi, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, there was a time in, you know, uh, I was pushing digitization, doing talks all over the country about it. Siyempre, like you said, no, there are people na were into it, there are people who are not into it, there are people who are sitting on the fence. Tapos na pandemic happened, boom! Wala ka no choice. You have to get into digital. Yeah, so saying that, you know, with Prosperna, we can, you know, create your website for you and your e-commerce website for you. And then from there, you know, without having to do any coding whatsoever, click lang kung anong klaseng gusto niyong payment. Online bank transfer, 7-Eleven payments, uh, Paymaya, Gcash, uh, all of these payment integration, uh, uh, payment platforms, it's there already. And then after that, so syempre, bayad ka na. May bumili na ng produkto mo. Paano i deliver yeah. Kasama na rin sa services ng Prosper na yun. You just click kung anong gusto mong delivery platform. May, we have Mr. Speedy, we have JNT, we have uh, Lala Move, you know, and we have more than 15 delivery uh, platforms already integrated with us. What are your thoughts about what's happening to business right now? Entrepreneurship business? Uh, that's a very good question, Carl. No? So, obviously, pandemic, you know, lockdowns, IATF regulations. Um, there was a time na people would think there were there were people that that thought that maybe after three months tapos na to, four months tapos na to. But obviously, that's not the reality, diba? Yeah. Tapos, people are saying, can't wait for the new normal, diba? Pag, when everything's said and done. Uh, but for me, as a you know, negosyante, the normal is what is present right now. Diba? What, 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 what is the situation right now? That's the normal that you have to work with. Uh, in saying that, um, um, si Tita Bing Lim Ho, who's with you know, uh, Philippine Franchise Association and Frank yeah. she she told me something. Uh, it's during times of crisis that uh, real entrepreneurs shine. Wow. Uh, yeah. uh, saying that, uh, you know, um, you see that, you know, the, 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 from an overall industry sector, obviously, maraming natamaan, right? Mm. F&B, for one, right? A lot of restaurants can't open, dine-in is not allowed, right? But here's the thing, yung mga nag-adjust ng maaga, yeah. they were able to survive and thrive, right? There's a uh, popular coffee shops na local, ah, not, 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 not uh, in, uh, international brands that, you know, they, they shifted their staff around so that they could lessen their, uh, you know, letting people go, right? Give people work. Um, and then at the same time, uh, well, to the point of this uh, topic for tonight, went online. Yeah. Right? Um, the, the retail sector here in the Philippines has actually been growing very well. And the, the forecast is actually still pretty good. And research shows that uh, retailers are still very highly optimistic considering everything, right? And ang pinaka, uh, the people, the, the companies that uh, have been thriving, surviving, thriving, and actually growing are those who adapted to digital yeah. uh, faster, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, you know, uh, and maganda dyan, companies like uh, big sports brands like Toby, Spen Shop, ang ganda ng ano, ng interface nila pag gusto mag-order. Right? Tapos ang bilis. Fitness and health has actually been a growing industry. Obviously kasi, work from home, di ba? Dami yeah. nag-order ng mga workout equipment, di ba? Um, food and beverage, it actually created a whole new batch of entrepreneurs. Yeah. Right? Especially when it comes to social selling. And you see people who are, you know, they actually got distribution setups from other brands so that mm-hmm. they can distribute that in their community. Yeah. Yan ang maganda dyan, Carly. Yung, 
the, the, the this whole pandemic situation created uh, the need to be entrepreneurial because Bro, yeah, you need you need money yeah all right you i know? want to add but i don't want to add on guys sa mga nakikinig ang galing ng sinabi ni Fro na i want you guys to simmer on that ah, wherein there's so many opportunities right now for you to become an entrepreneur Diba? Either you still work for a company, uh, Monday to Saturday, Monday to Friday, pero wag mo sasayangin yung Saturday and Sunday. Now is really an opportune time to do something. No, bro? Yes. And I saw a lot of people na, and even my friends na, I thought they, they would be entrepreneurial, pero uh, galing ng ginawa nila you know, nung pandemic. Right? The, it triggered their, their entrepreneurial skills. To, to the point let na... The, Fro, let Sorry. me go to the audience and ask the audience. Sa mga nanonood ng live, can you go to the chat box and type, ano ba mga gamit ang madalas nyo bilhin ngayon online na hindi nyo naman binibili before online, pre-pandemic? Outside of the digital, ano ba mga nauso ng mga uh, products ng pandemic? Alam mo, alam ko may mga bagong uso ngayon, but kapa, kapa, kapanahunan ng ubi pandesa yung sushi bake. Yes! Yeah. Oh my God, the sushi bake. Dalgona. I, I love sushi. I love eating. Same here. Parang man. sino nagsimula ng sushi bake? Diba? Parang galing. Na, isang tray? Yeah. Ready to eat? Diba? Yes. Tinanggal lang nila yung yung how it was presented in restaurants. Yeah. yeah. Because well, obviously we can go to restaurants. Pero value for money you get a big tray of Uh, your favorite sushi together with the rice and everything and ready to eat. <laughs> and Fro, alam mo, ito nakatuwa to ah. Uh, alam mo ba na may gumawa ng sushi bake? Kasi sushi bake dati parang 800 eh, medyo malaki. Uh, alam mo ba you can go to food court ng SM and may nagbibenta ng sushi bake per piece ng brownies. Talaga? Oh, 30 pesos, parang ganun. So hindi mo na kailangan bilhin yung buong tray kasi meron ng 30 pesos. So you can, ako, I will order three flavors. Uh, and then na satisfy yung craving ko na sushi bake so nakakatawa no guys so, may mga nag chat box ito ano ba mga binili nyo dati my chairs yeah. Yeah. office chairs. furniture office yeah. furniture yeah. Uh, just for the sake of you know, I'm, uh, you know I, I like having fun I still did buy a uh, office chair so ito pa rin yung upuan ko ala <laughs> <laughs> pero yeah uh I have a friend who's in the office furniture business and uh, yeah, uh, doing pretty well with you know, with 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 selling furniture online. Because especially now that we work from home, you want to make it as comfortable and as um, easy for you, yeah, exactly. right? To to adjust and you know, um, especially with people with families. Right? No, wala yung ano eh, delineation between family time and and uh, work time. Eh. So you have to create that situation.